was here. So your father and who else was with you today? My father, my two little sisters, and my brother. And the one that you said, this is the man, this is the man. Who is that? This is my little brother. That's Tully. Why is he so special to you? Um, I mean, he's two two point oh. You know, uh, my mentor, my little brother, and um, you know, I, I just hope he can be better than me. You know, so. With Tully, it was a, a very, uh, I, I guess he, we could say it's special. But uh, he started as center, which is true. And uh, I first coached Tolia. Uh, it goes back in, uh, I think they were like second or third grade. Tolia had a sharp snap. I mean, it was like a, a field goal snap. So sometimes Tua gets coding for missing his snap because he snapped so hard. It's the dad has got to tell Tolia, like, uh, can you ease off on a, a speed? Tolia would always work on his snapping the ball back to Tua. Tua would work on his drops and his throws, not realizing that every critique that dad made to Tua, Taulia was retaining all of that. And so he kind of shocked us. When Tua went on to high school, we needed to find a quarterback. And one thing I knew about Taulia, he could throw. I mean, Pastor Daddy's really the, the first one to, to tell my dad that Leah should be our, our quarterback and stuff. And he really believed in me. <laughs> I didn't even see anything about me being a quarterback and stuff. That's like every center's dream, is to go from center to quarterback, because you rarely see that, you know? And the center never gets attention, right? No one's watching the O-line except their moms. It was crazy. I mean, I had to lose a lot of weight, different eating, different training, different mindset. But being around Tua and uh, growing up with the older boys, I mean, it really matured me quick. But I mean, it was, it was all worth it. From where he's come to where he's at now, you know, I'd, I'd say I'm very proud of my brother. First of all, I just want to thank God for this opportunity to uh, announce my commitment, uh, commit to Alabama, Rose High. You know, there was something about Pastor Dad that had that vision, you know, in both Tua and Taulia, mm -hmm. that they were going to be uh, a special quarterbacks. As a father, you don't see that because you work with them and you're always grinding, but I'm pretty sure. Any dad that would be in my situation would be proud. So this will be the first time that they'll be playing again in years and actually be playing the same position. That, that's never happened before. Yeah. I think it's only going to get the both of them better. They've been competing since high school. You know, they might not play against each other, but you know, they always compete. You know, they, they're always questioning each other on their, uh, their stats. stats and you know, everything else that goes on. I'm gonna try to make sure my brother red shirts so so he doesn't have to give up that year of eligibility. Tua can talk sometimes, so it's, it's cool. It's an area. Whatever it may be, I mean he's he's just gonna have to work, I'm just gonna have to work. And I think we're just gonna have to, to to go from there, you know, just getting each other better. It's not gonna be easy for him, I know that, so I know that he's always working, so I gotta keep working. Let me just put it this way, Tobia, you will have your time. For now, it is two time. <laughs> this series is brought to you by Westgate Luxury Condominiums. Now under construction and located only 200 steps from Bryant-Denny Stadium, Westgate features luxury units for the ultimate Alabama fan and catered tailgating for every Alabama home game. Learn more at WestgateAL.com.